Hello everyone, for today's video is I'm going to show you how to operate the bilge water separator. Bilge water separator on board ships is used to discharge bilge water which is less than 15 ppm to the sea in accordance with the regulations. So here from the dirty bilge water tank our bilge water will be suctioned by the use of the bilge separator pump going to the bilge separator wherein it will be filtered out here going to the oil content monitoring wherein if it is less than 15 ppm then our bilge water will be going overboard and if it is more than 15 ppm then this valve will automatically close and open this one so that our more than 15 ppm bilge water will go to the clean bilge water tank so to start the operation i need to press shift f1 now it's in running condition you have 35, 35 minutes to fulfill, fulfill the assessment, the assessment. okay I'm going to emergency switchboard make sure to in the breaker go to the bilge wells check that it is an automatic uh, switch on the electric heater and we are going to wait until this uh, temperature will reach up to 50 degrees celsius before we can make this separator operation in auto and as of now we can uh, uh, line up the valves so i'm going to open first the main seawater sea chest first before because we are going to do the flushing and later on i will also open this one so as of now we are going to wait for the temperature to rise up to 50 degrees celsius Hello everyone, for today's video I am going to be discharging the village separate. Now that we have already reached 50 degrees Celsius, I'm going to put the separator operation in automatic, start the bilge separator pump for a while to flush it with seawater, and after flushing, I'm going to acknowledge the alarm. I'm just going to acknowledge this one because this is still racing, this is still going up, so after a while it will uh, normalize. So I'm going to open this valve and put the pump control in automatic. And by the way guys, I'm just going to keep this main seawater sea chest valve open for the sake of the score. But in reality, after the flushing process, we can close this valve. And if there is an alarm because of high ppm content which is more than 15 ppm so just acknowledge and 
make sure that our valves should change over. So from this one, it should change over to this one. It should open this. That's it. And I hope that you learned something new for today. Bye-bye. Ciao.